Good evening, good evening everyone. This is Pran Jaiwal. Today I am going to present a brief overview of my project, which is Apna Bharat Bus Booking Reservation System. It is a pretty cool system in which the project is responsible for end-to-end -end user ticket generation to its confirmation of its bus. The main tech stack is uses Python, SQLite, Tinker, and the concepts of DBMS which is database management system and I have used some of the libraries of JavaScript for better enhancement of this project. Here is my table of content which includes the home section, next is seat booking section, third is checkbook seat section, fourth one is add bus detail section. If I go to the home section in which there are mainly three sections seat booking, view book seat, add bus details. Now here comes the start page in which like on running the python program you will have this project page which is uh, username and the mobile number he has he need to enter or that management system has already been preserved. So when I click on the start it will show my three options seat booking checkbook see add bus details yeah it is important to note that add bus details is for admins only that is the bus conductor no passengers can add bus details so if i click on the seat booking session here comes the three options like uh, enter the journey details to take the availability of seat enter your traveling date choose your preferred seat and proceed to enter the user details So here comes the seat booking page. Like it consists of various sections like from arrival to destination, the journey date, and for journey date I have used a calendar library which is included in the Python for pretty functional and enhancement of this project. Yeah, it will show all the available options like bus. It is showing the bus one, India Travels operator, bus type, AC sleeper, two into two, two into three, three into three number of the seats available and the fare it is 1500 yeah so if you wish you can proceed to the book for this for proceed to book you need to fill your name choose your gender choosing the number of seats the mobile number for and the age like if you are confirmed with your seat it will prompt the total fare will be are you okay to the proceed uh, yeah if you click on the yes it will go on the next page and if you know it will go to the home page or will re remain at this page only like if i go to the next page it will show me the bus ticket a uh, sample bus ticket in which the name of the passenger will be printed the number of the seats the age the traveling date the gender the phone number the fare number fare rupees bus id and boarding point that is delhi from Bhopal. Yeah, if you want to choose next ticket, you can go to the home option or you can, yeah, eliminate it. You can go with this ticket. So, hey, this is my overview of the project. Now, I'm going to present the actual functionality of my project. The number of features and the number of what I need to have in my project to enhance it. So, like I have mentioned all the issues that need to be addressed for this program like in this I need to have new feature in the interface wise and functionality wise and you can add the dynamic fare for stations for small routes need to have strong password enforcement using during the registration and you can have the option of add seat matrix feature like similar to what we seen in red bus app so yeah you can have the features which are quite similar to the red bus app now, this is the overview of the project if you wish you can contribute in this projects yeah. thank you everyone